Right guys, so there's been another update on the DJI Fly app and also your RC and your RC2. So I thought what I'd do, I'll just show you the two screens anyway. Uh, login session expiring, whatever that's on about. I'll check that later on. I'm just trying to remember now how you get into your... Okay. So what we need to do is go into camera view. And it's the same with this one, camera view. Right, off we go. About, check for updates. About, check for updates. Okay, that one's saying I need an update. Uh, just do this one again. Network, okay. Right, so this is another thing I remember now. With the RC, you've got to make sure that you're connected to the internet. <laughs> okay. So that was something I forgot myself. Okay, so I'm in now. All right, let's come back out. Update. Now, another thing also, guys, I'm gonna see how long it takes on both of these. As you can see, they're po both different. But also, not forgetting your fly app on your phone or your tablet. So let's have a look at the RC first. So there's a few things slightly different. So on the RC, we've got support, update, fly share for fast file transfer directly. Supports independent app update without the need of simultaneous update remote without the phone. Where, whereas the RC2 has added support for the DJI goggles free because obviously there's a new, a new drone come out yesterday, which is the uh, Avata 2 uh, with goggles, um, hand controller, all new stuff. I thought a pretty good price, but unfortunately my bank account won't <laughs> get that. Um, added support, updated fly share and, um, yeah, anyway, what I will say, because I'm not going to go into the depths of all this, guys, because um, there, there are so many videos come out now with the updates. Uh, if you want to check out Nobby's channel, very informative, and Gavin as well, especially Gavin's channel, because he brought up about the authorizations of your flight logs, which we will talk about near the end of this video. Because once this is all downloaded, I can just show you what I'm on about with that. And also, guys, you don't have to have your drone on when you're doing this. It's only to do with your phone, your tablet, depending on if you've got Android or iOS, and with your two controllers. So what I'm going to do now, I've got my DJI RC N2. And I'm just going to connect it up to the phone just to make sure everything is hunky dory. Okay, that's interesting. I've just opened up my app and I've gone straight into before flying in Spain. Check out now. And even though it says, <laughs> it says, B, it says China. Yes. Yes. Anyway, we come out of that. Okay, so I'm just going to do the same thing here on my controller. We just go over to um, the settings on that. Okay. And we just check for updates. I think. Okay, it's saying I need an aircraft connected for that. So there you can see I've got firmware for my Air 3 and also got 
uh, firmware for my controller as well. Uh, pips and bugs. So what a palaver! So obviously doing that, you've got to put on your drone when you're using the RCM one and RCM two. So that means I've got to do my RCM one. But that's only for people that's got obviously got um, all these types of controllers, guys. So you just got to remember that it's they all got different procedures. They all got different numbers. If you notice, but I have been noticing, especially um, with this controller, I've had quite a few issues with it. And one of those was that when I was doing the videos, it was saying I did the videos the day tomorrow and also sometimes the the timings are out i've had quite a few things wrong with it so it's good at long last they have been doing updates obviously they've been having some issues uh with it because if you watch my videos i showed you a few things where i think there was something going not going right interesting enough uh we'll be discussing later on about the authorization of flight logs um, it does to me seem that DJI do even though we're good, I'm gonna say no they still got control over your controllers I'm not bothered about it some people are some people uh, making a big thing of it especially in the US but I'm not really bothered about it but I still think they can have some sort of control over the controllers uh, but I've had a few issues so, and I'm not the only one thankfully so my RC is already updated now at long last <laughs> the other two seem to be taking their time um, right quick transfer so th these are the um, I think this one, the quick transfer, is pretty. There's loads of videos out there, guys, about that. Now, fly share is slightly different. Um, same sort of thing. I personally never use any of these. Um, maybe because I don't use the social networks for sharing my stuff, but it it's optional, and I'm sure there's plenty of videos out there um, that you can look at. So what I want to do guys is go into profile. See it's all different, isn't it? Okay, so what it's saying there is authorization to DJI uh, so they can analyze your uh, for obviously I haven't got no insurance on any of my drones. So to me personally, I don't think I need that. And I'll just notice that at the top there, craftily they got it at the top as well. Uh, so if I just knock off that little cross there, <laughs> which they don't, right. But I notice that at the top there, right, just done it. So it is a bit of a fiddle, I don't see the point of them analysing my every time I fly them. If I have, I have a major issue, and the only major issue I would ever have is if that my drone decided to fly off somewhere. Anyway, as you can see, now the other two are starting to gain up speed now. So, guys, take your time with that. I mean, it's up to you if you want to say, yes, you can authorise it, so every time you go out flying, they will analyze your flights but to me personally i haven't got the um fly safe deal anyway the insurance so there's no benefit to me at all I don't, I, they don't need to have a look what i'm up to but anyway that, that's your option so anyway we can come out of that now i'm going to turn off this controller Unfortunately, I can't turn my drone off because um, it's still downloading. So one down, two to go. If you notice, there's 
total different setup now with the RCN. If you notice now, there's a total different setup with the RC2 now to compared with the RC. Interesting that you've got Chinese writing as well. <laughs> now the RC2 is done now. Just do the quick transfer. So there you are, the quick transfer. You just follow the instructions and the fly safe. Same sort of thing. If you remember to tap that little icon there, that will do the share. I've, there's plenty of videos that, like I said before, I never use this facility anyway, but I suppose it's it's there for a reason. Okay, so profile. We got the flights there, so we press more. There it is. Uh, flight record authorization authorized DJI to analyze flight records sync to cloud for a quick issue and uh, you know so they just want to check your flights but to me I think that's more to do if you've got the insurance through DJI um, yeah it, it covers them and it covers yourself but for me I never use it I never use that insurance anyway that's your preference but I don't need to uh, them to do that but you've got to remember guys at the top there just click that off um, and if there is I mean like I said before if you've got an issue and my only issue would be if ever in touch what has never happened with the newer drones if the drone decided to fly off uh, for no reason at all then I would just download the flight that I've that's been needed for DJI to check it out anyway so that one's done now now I've got a horrible feeling <laughs> that uh, what I'll tell you what I will do I'll just go back it into just to make sure nothing else needs to be updated um, because one of the things I did, I'm just going to check updates there a minute. That's updated. Uh, one issue I did have was the safety data. For, okay, so I can't do that until the aircraft's connected. What I'm going to do later on, I don't think I'll put it in the video, is I'm going to connect this to my Air 3. Okay, what I'm going to do later on, I'm going to just come out of this a minute and come out of that. Okay, got to come. What I'm going to do later on, I want to sync my Air Free up to my RC2 uh, and make sure there's no updates on that. It's, it's what I mean, guys. It, God, it's, if you've got so many drones like me, and I know there's a few people out there who's got the same same thing been a bit of a drone nut you got to go through it all check it all I'll have to check my uh, DJI RCM1 as well to make sure that that's probably going to need an update so yeah that's what I called it the nightmare <laughs> anyway that one's done this one's finished with now I can turn that off so hopefully my app for my drone and obviously it's connected to my uh, DJI RCN2 so gonna need this one to check out later and this is another thing about making sure guys that your batteries and your controllers are all up to date and thinking about it I'm just gonna update this one now well no, I'm gonna charge up the power on this one because what I want to do is go out and do a test flight anyway I'm doing a, another video today to do with which will be coming out on Sunday and that's um, the dolly zoom but with my air free should get so much better effect that's the plan anyway <laughs> so we'll just move that out of the way just going to put that in there a minute so I'll just put in my DJI RCM1. I'll go check out next. What I will also do is connect that up with my Mini 2. So anyway, the 
flight fly safe date was done so that's good um even though it's okay so that that's a what to date we'll just check on that okay different setup there as well noticed on the android why that is i don't know so somebody else can ask me that somebody else can answer that question why is the quick save quick transfer different to this so something else <laughs> i'm just not with it all right buying the controller or goggles uh the flyaway coverage okay i'll, I'll we'll do the bind now is the drone still on yet confirm So that's my RCM1, right. So we're just gonna go back into this one. Okay. We're just gonna go uh, about, check for updates. I've probably done that. Just up them up to date. So that, that's good. So I can come all out of that. So I've got my air free on. We go back into connection guide. We can't bind that, obviously. Change the bind device. Guys, if you don't do this, I think you get like four attempts of flying it and then it just, um, it won't better fly anymore. So you've got, you got to have to bind it together, as binding together as well. I'll just do the usual check for updates. That's all up to date, that's good. But I know my, see that one up to date. So we just do that, do that. Now I think I got like 15% and then it just wouldn't do any more. I even got an update on the tablet. <laughs> so that was good. Okay, so we're up to date on that. Let's just check here again. Off. Okay, interesting why it's different on your app than it is on the controllers. But anyway, hey ho. I'm just going to check one more thing, uh, and that's to do to make sure. As, see, it, it's it, even though I cross that off, it's it's back up there. So, just be aware of that, guys. Okay, next thing I'm gonna check. Um, this is something else that Nobby and Gavin made known was you can do your updates now on your controller, which is good. So, and I'll just do that as well. So that's all up to date. So, yep, some improvements, I must say. So what I'm going to do now, I'm going to go out and we're going to check out if there's any problems. There shouldn't be, but you never know. So I've just done all my updates. I'm outside now. Lovely day. It's a bit of wind about, but that doesn't matter. So I've just turned on the controller. I've turned on my uh air free before i'm going to take that drone off what i will do guys is about format your card um if we go into camera and scroll down to the formatting which is my sd card so if i press format bonnie yes format hang on i've got my dog here right so it's formatting the sd card just want to empty the card off. I've got my dog whinging. Yeah, babes. So the dog's done. My card's done now. So <laughs> that's the first thing out of the way. So the next thing I want to do is get a drone up in the air, make sure that the new update on the controller hasn't caused a problem. Take off. Okay. 
All looking good, no, no, nothing going on at the moment. Just going to send the drone up. Just going to turn it around to where I am. Master shots. Okay, I don't know if you can capture, the, capture it. Anyway, I've got master shots on there. Has that got me? Okay, it's got me. Three, two, I've got a few more one. seagulls. You can see them flying over the, <laughs> the screen. I've got the dog. Okay, we'll see what happens here. He's... I have to keep an eye on that seat. This sea seat, so it could be what it is. There might be babies over there. They don't. I mean, they do come out on this patch. I must be honest. That's it, Bonnie. Where's my drone? So he's still over there. He still got me on it. Right, the seagulls are over there. <laughs> I must do a video on birds, because I've seen a few videos where they put like red tape on the drone, and that seems to uh, distract. Bonnie, no. There's a dog coming down here as well. So I'm have to put you in the car in a minute. Right, the drone's coming in. I can't believe. Oh, he's coming up to it. Right. I was going to do a, a video here um, showing the dolly zoom, but I think I'll, I'll move to another location because they're big birds. The old, uh, <laughs> the seagulls, yeah. Right, so the drone. Okay. Got... Do it. Spotlight. Okay, I've still got the the, the video on there. Oh, it's do, it's doing what it should be doing. Okay, I'm just doing a what what I'm trying out is just a circle around it. Yeah, that's all right. That's, that's good. Okay, so the the seagulls have had enough for the moment. <laughs> I don't know where these people have gone, Bonnie. Oh, saying that. No, they haven't. They're over here now. <laughs> okay. I thought the seagulls would had enough of me, but I can see they're over there now. Okay. So anyway, we'll stop that. So I'm going to bring the drone back because I've done enough testing. Everything to me looks fine. Did a couple of tests, did the master shots. That seemed all fine. I mean, I, what I always do, I always go back and check the uh, video footage as well to see if there's any problems with the footage, like if it's singing or whatever. Um, and then I did the spotlight around the building over there. Seagulls wanted to play. Thankfully, they didn't want to play my drone. <laughs> so yeah, everything was fine. So that, that's the main thing, because if you remember, I had to rebound this contraption with uh, my Air 3 as well after the new update. So it all looking good. So guys, if you have any problems, let me know. Um, if you've probably seen in this video, it's a bit of a nightmare, especially if you've got quite three or four drones with different controllers. If you use the Android, if you use uh, iOS <laughs> and obviously the different screens. So anyway, as always, very much for watching. I'll catch you in another video very soon. Mm -hmm.